Hi, welcome to Girl Who Reads. I'm Donna, and I thought I'd give you a video overview of what's coming up on my blog this week and what I'm reading. First up tomorrow, I have a review of Vaccine Nation. Yes, I've been reading it since April, and I finally finished it this weekend. So um, come check it out. I didn't really like the book, so um, I try not to be too harsh in my review. Let me know what you think. Um, also on Wednesday, I'm happy to have Abby Glines. She's a brand new author. She writes the um, young adult romance novel, Breathe, that was published this past May by Wild Child Publishing. She's going to be sharing about her character, so please stop by and um, find out a little bit more about this wonderful book. Then on Thursday, I'm going to be partic participating in the Kate Files Review Appreciation Day blog hop, and the theme is da -da -da, Harry Potter. Couldn't have guessed that. Not with, you know, there's a movie or something coming out on Friday, I think. Yeah, I'm a big fan, even though I came to the party a little late. So I hope you'll stop by on Thursday to see what I and a whole lot of other bloggers think about Harry Potter. As for what I'm reading this week, still on my list, Tribulation Point. I'm about 30 pages in. I'm not connecting to the characters. The storyline is moving a little slow, but I'm hoping it'll pick up and I will make it through it this week. I picked up um, To Read in the Pool, a library book I bought at a charity sale. It was probably a quarter. I really liked the cover of Queen of the Big Time. I don't even know if I knew what the book was about before I bought it because I just liked the cover that much. But it says it's set in the late 1800s, about a village of Italians that immigrate all together to America. I'm hoping that it'll be a little bit of a funny re read. I also have, of course, my trusty Nook, which I thought I broke this week. It turned out I just forgot to charge it over the weekend, over my vacation. I'm still reading Convergence by J.D. Watts. It's a young adult paranormal romance that's really good. It has angels in it, and um, there's going to be a big battle of good versus evil. And so and I'm ho hoping to finish that as well this week. As far as audiobooks, I'm still listening to The Undomesticated Goddess. Um, it's kind of quirky. The main character, Samantha, grates on my nerves just slightly but um, not so badly that I had to give it up. So I'm hoping the last couple hours we read this week, or listened to this week, and then I'll pick up Room. I'm kind of intrigued by its concept of being told from a five-year-old's point of view. And so that's what I'm reading this week. And as it's Monday, I want to know what you're reading. Leave a comment, and if you link to your blog, I will um, pay you a visit. All right, have a great week, and I'll see you next week. Bye.